Hi Scrappers, in this video I've got a integrated dishwasher, one of the ones you put the your cupboard door onto it basically, so dishwasher looks like all stainless, haven't really checked anything yet, only just got hold of it so I'm going to take it apart, see what it's worth and yeah, I'll get back to you alright, so I've done a tear down so this is all the steel which comes out of the uh, dishwasher and a bucket but the bucket weighs hardly nothing so we've got the steel in there at 10 pence a kilogram so we've got one pound 74 in steel so that's just the sides back a few little bits of structural stuff to keep it together then we have more steel, it's just all the stuff to keep the uh, plates and dishes in place. So we've got the plastic coating on there, but it's still steel. So at 10 p that's going for 45 pence, that stuff. So I'll add that onto the other steel. So now we've got the stainless sort of inside to it. So it's all this, we've got the door, we've got the front bit, which had a bit of glass in there, which was smashed out. Got all this weird stuff on there, so they might give me a little bit less for that. But um, stainless is uh, 70 pence, so that's worth 10 uh, 10 pounds, what's that? 10 pounds 85 for the, for the inside of it. So, like I said, they might give me a little bit less. To be honest, I've never taken stainless in with this much, like a fiberglass or something. Not really sure what it is. You get it on the bottom of sinks as well, but there's only a tiny bit, so they don't really worry. But to be honest, this is caped in it, so they might give me a little bit less. But so yeah, ten pound eighty-five. Right, so we've just got the last few bits now. So we've got a motor, a couple of low-grade boards, and a load of cable. So um, yeah, so cable. Let's just. Got an empty one. It's a cable at one pound sixty a kilo, so one pound fourteen for the cable. This bit here is worth a little bit less of so one pound twenty a kilo for that stuff, but I just chucked it in because there's one bit of it. So knock off a couple of pence, I guess. Then the motor which is 40 pence a kilo is worth 85 pence but some nice copper in there I did scratch it off somewhere that is copper so I'll be chucking it in with my other ones and then be taking them all apart so I'm gonna do a video soon about that as well just to how much copper is in one motor basically so 85 if you just sell it how it is but obviously it's well it's going to be worth more taking that apart. And then low grade boards. Uh, 15 pence a kilo is worth 7 pence for those little boards. But what I do, what I will do is um, get these like crystal oscillators. So it's a little tiny one. I'll take them off. I'll probably end up ripping the transformer off, chuck it in my transformer bucket. Uh, that's about it on that little IC chip in there, but I won't worry about that. Then you've got the tactile switches, which got the tiniest amount of silver in there. Don't know why, but I can't help myself. I'll rip them off and chuck them in a little part, and at some point, I'm gonna find an easier way to get that silver out because they are literally tiny. I'll take them out. More tactile switches on that one nothing on that one so yeah all in so we have got steel we've got stainless steel we've got cables motors low grade boards um in the uk you'll get 15 pound 10 pence uh in america you'll get 18 dollars 39 cents uh canada 24 dollars 67 cents in australia you'll get $24.20 so uh, it took me, took me about 45 minutes to uh, take it apart 
So, 15 pound and 45 minutes. Uh, I picked it up when I was on the way back from somewhere else, so I didn't go out literally just to get that. I literally found it as I was coming back home. So yeah, guys, um, dishwashers are definitely worthwhile. So if you see them on the side of the road, definitely pick them up, especially if they like look stainless. Yeah, keep scrapping, guys.